Hey guys, today we've got some new apps for you. We'll start off with Aussie Toilets. So this is an app that tells you where the nearby public toilets are. So it doesn't have many configuration options or anything like that. So as you jump in, your basic setting is to allow location service. Without that, the app would not work, I'm guessing. And so once you pick it up, it just gives you your nearby location and shows you the various uh, toilets that are near these locations and you cannot enter a location and search for it as such but you can zoom in and zoom out of the map or you can just use zoom controls and clicking on any particular option will give you the address what are the facilities available and the hours are up uh, the hours of operations and yeah so that is a simple app next up we have slider which is a slided keyboard for Windows Phone. It does not replace the stock keyboard, but within the app you can use a slide keyboard. And so you just drag across what you want to type, and most of the time it will get the right keywords. Otherwise you can pick one of the options from here, or just type in as you would normally do. And once you're done, you got various options in here, which is SMS, email, search, or copy to clipboard. So you can copy the clipboard, and then you get your standard copy uh, interface. Or you can click on SMS, and then you can pick uh, contact, and your message will be pasted in here automatically. So in the configuration option, you can choose your language, uh, enable auto capitalize, and things like that. And yep, yeah, so that is a quick look at Slider. Next up, we can take a look at WNM Live. So this is an app, a social networking kind of app, which automatically pulls other users who use this particular network using the Windows Phone app or the web and things like that and you get options to call them, text them and uh, share pictures with them etc. So if you jump into your live stream you'll see that it has various pivots where it shows you the recent uh, messages on there and if you want to jump into a conversation with any one of those folks you just click on them and then you see their profile and then you got the option to favorite them message them call them or in some cases if you want to block them you can do that or report user so when you go in first it doesn't always recognize it but you can just swipe back and then it comes up with that information and then you've got your favorites if you've favorited anybody and nearby which uses your location based services and pulls up information about con uh, people who are in your vicinity and I'll show you the messages from them and so yeah it's a simple app and the results are kind of unfiltered so it's, it might not be suitable for everyone out there but if you're into those kind of things you can check out WNM Live, which is available for free from the marketplace. And the last app that we'll take a look at today is called Cycle Walkman. So this particular app offers various modules. So you've got your relaxation, anti-addiction, and things like that. So when you jump into any one of those programs, you've got submenus in there which is for different things. So in this case of anti-addiction, you've got anti-smoke, no alcohol, internet addiction, things like that. So when you pick any one of those, it'll show you what are the available options on that. So you can change the color of the light that the app uses, choose a background music, and change the override the uh, default program length. And then when you start the program, the screen will flash a bit and this is supposed to enhance or allow you to quit the addiction. So 
So basically what you have to do is, like in this particular image, you got to place the phone near your eyes and close your eyes slightly and not all the way and this is supposed to help you. I'm not really sure how well this works because I haven't tried it myself but yeah this is an app that claims to do this so in this case this particular program tells you that it'll help you cut down your smoking so if you do try it do let us know how it works out for you and yeah those are the four apps that we have for you today and we'll bring more apps later. Thanks for watching.